So, are you ready to go home now? Hmm? Home? I'm enjoying the yacht. <gasps> Wait a second. My mom. What about your mom? Is she okay? Did something happen? Well, the thing is, I kind of told her that if I wasn't back within an hour to call the police because that means you kidnapped me. And I think she might have done it. Dude, what? Why would you say that? Um, well, because before tonight, you were just my creepy neighbor who was obsessed with me. That's why. So, I was very scared to go on this date. You do remember that you blackmailed me into this. I mean, should I just trust you all of a sudden? Well, I wouldn't even have brung you here if I would have known that. Dude, we gotta get out of here before she actually calls the cops. I'm three hours late. I'm sure she did. This is gonna be bad. Look, okay, tonight was great, but I've got to go. Maybe we can do this again some other time, but my mom is gonna kill me. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. I gotta get home now. <gasps> oh, shoot. Mom, you're here with the cops. Calm down, everything's fine. I'm fine, I just lost track of time. I, I forgot to call you, Mom. My phone didn't have any signal out on the water. Are you serious, young lady? Do you know how worried sick I was? You tried to make me feel bad for making you hang out with him, and then boom, you stay out all night on a school night at that. How dare you, young lady? You are in so much trouble when we get home. What are you even doing out here? Yeah, when your mom called us, she was very worried. She said you were kidnapped, and she said you told her that's what happened. That was before, and, and this is now, okay? I'm really sorry about the confusion, but I'm okay. I'm really okay. Yeah, sorry, ma'am. All this was my fault. I got a little carried away. We're okay, though. Okay or not okay? This little date you got going on is over. Yeah, you don't even have enough time to get rest for school now. Get your butt in this cop car. All right, all right. Well, I told you this would be bad, but... I gotta go now. Sorry about that. It's cool. We'll just hang out another time. Oh, please. You're not hanging around my daughter ever again. This was very irresponsible of you. And I trusted you. Well, we've gotta go now. So get home, kid. It's super late. You are no longer welcome at my house. And you're no longer welcome to hang out with my daughter anymore. You're not a good influence like I thought you were. Oh, um, sorry about this again. Goodbye, guys. I didn't mean to offend anyone. You're the one who forced me to go on the date with the creepy neighbor kid. And I went, okay? There's really nothing to be mad about and no reason to tell him he can't hang out with me anymore. We're just now actually becoming friends. Yes, well, you're the one who said that if you were gone for longer than an hour to call the police. Do you know how serious of an accusation that is, young lady? You cannot say something like that and expect me to not be upset. I am seriously stressing out right now. You have me worried sick for your safe date. And if that's what's gonna come with you being in a relationship, you're banned from boys. You got that? You're absolutely absolutely banned from having a boyfriend. And that's final. Now go to your room. Uh, Mom, that's not even fair. I said go to your room. It's six o'clock in the morning. You're supposed to be at school in an hour. Good night. Great. How unfair is that? I'm the one in trouble and banned from boys. How can you even ban me from boys? That doesn't make any sense. She's the one who said I could go. And now you're all upset at me. This is just stupid. I'm just gonna take a shower and forget any of this ever happened. Ah, now this is nice and peaceful. Ah, I had so much fun at the yacht though. Too bad I never get to see him again because my mom is a gremlin. She just doesn't understand me. And just when we were becoming good friends, too. Psst. Hey, hello? Are you here? Can you hear me? Ray, where are you? Huh? What the heck was that noise? Mom, what do you want? Will you go up? <gasps> what are you doing here? Are you trying to get me in trouble? Open up. Let me in. We need to talk. Uh, dude. No, we don't. I need to get dressed. You can't just show up here without announcing yourself. Well, your mom hates me. How could I announce myself? Come on. Open the door. This is important. Oh, you're just gonna have to wait. Hide in a bush or something. I'll be right back. Oh my gosh. What is he doing here? How embarrassing. Oh my goodness. Hurry it up, dude. Will you shut your face already? I'm coming. You're so impatient. Hey, I'm not the one who snuck in while I was taking a shower, was I? Get in here and be extra quiet. My mom is sleeping and would kill me if she knew you were here. What is it that you want to talk about anyways? <laughs> <laughs> nice pajamas. That is adorable. Do you always go to bed like that? Dude, not the time, okay? What do you want? Don't talk about my pajamas. My grandma bought me these. I can tell. But listen, I just wanted to talk to you about what happened. I did not mean to get you into any type of trouble at all. Yeah, I know. It was my fault because I didn't trust you. So I told her to call the police. Anyways, my main point was, uh, when am I going to see you again? <sighs> More than likely, never. My mom has completely banned me from boys and especially you. So that was our last time hanging out, dude. What? That's not happening, okay? We can't let that just slide. 
annoyed? Yeah, well, that's my mom. And she's the boss here, so there's nothing I can do about that. If she says I'm banned from boys, there's no way I'm gonna get around it. And she'll make sure no guy ever sets foot around me again. If she wasn't asleep right now, you wouldn't be able to even sneak through my backyard like the creep that you are. I mean, literally, what are you doing? We just got to be cool, and you're already showing your freak side again. Okay, this is not me stalking. This is me doing whatever I can to talk to my girlfriend. Uh, girlfriend, I never agreed to date you like that. You forced me to do this, remember? And now look, it ended terribly. I'm in trouble. And you're gonna be in trouble if you don't get out of here soon. I'm telling you, my mom is a crazy one. Look, I'm not gonna let this just slide. I'll find another way to see you. Trust me, I'll think about it. I mean, we do still have school together, so I'll always see you there. Um, I guess. And speaking of school, it's gonna start soon, so you should probably get out of here before my mom wakes up. There's no way she's letting me walk to school alone. All right, all right, fine. I'm out. He's absolutely crazy for showing his face around here. I need to go to bed and act like this never happened. I know I'll never be able to see him again, but at least I can see him at school. Yeah, that's the good part. Wake up. Let's go. Let's go. No time to sleep. You've got a busy day ahead of you and I got to get to work. So move it. Oh, Ma, why are you yelling? I barely got any sleep. You think you could just chill out? Do I have to go to school today? It was a long night, you know. Oh, dear. I'm sure it was a really, really long night. Yeah, you don't have to go to school. That's okay. I wasn't going to send you there today anyways, okay? Oh, really? Oh, I get to sleep in. Mom, you're the best. Seriously, I mean it. You're so thoughtful. Yeah, I really am. I even thought about what you're going to do all day. While I'm at work, since I can't trust you to hang around boys responsibly, and there's tons of boys all over the school, you're actually going to stay here and clean my entire house from head to toe. And it better be spotless when I come back or I'm sending you off to boarding school, okay? Um, what? Oh, yeah, yeah. So I'd get started if I were you. Here you go. Go ahead and just wipe everything down just like I showed you. The sponge is for you. Are you serious right now, Mom? Yeah, I'm serious. Now I've got to go because I'm a responsible young woman who needs to get to work. Goodbye. Have it done when I get home. Well, uh, I should have expected this from her. Of course I don't get to see boys. How could I see boys if I stay home and clean all day like a maid? Oh, this is just ridiculous. I mean, seriously. Seriously, this is how I get treated for finally giving the nice weird guy a chance, huh? I'm grounded forever and being shipped off to boarding school. There's no way I can finish this entire house by the time she gets back from work. I'd rather just go to school. <laughs> This is the worst. Hmm, this is weird. It's almost time for class and she's not here yet. I'll just call her. Something's going on. Yo, hello, yo. I'm waiting for you outside of school. You decided to ditch me, huh? You never want to see me again for real? This is the only time we have to see each other now that you're banned from boys, according to your mom. So when are you going to show up? Dude, I'm not going to show up, okay? I have to clean my entire house from top to bottom and make it spotless before my mom gets home from work today. And if I don't, she's sending me off to boarding boarding school. But it's just impossible. She wants me to go to boarding school because it's not possible for me to clean this entire house. So you might as well get rid of that dumb dream of ever seeing me again. Because it's not happening. You got that? It, it was nice knowing you. But I told you, she's crazy. And once she said I was banned, I think she meant it. But look, I still gotta try. So I'll just talk to you probably never again. This might be goodbye, but I have to go wash dishes now. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Well, well I can't let you get shipped off to boarding school. I, I can't let this happen. <sighs> Don't worry. I'm on my way. Huh? What do you mean you're on the way? Wait, hello? Hello? Are you here? Dude. <sighs> Looks like he hung up on me. He can't show up here. He's just gotta accept the fact that I'm leaving and that's final. Nothing I can do about it. Might as well keep washing dishes since this is my last day at this house anyway. Knock, knock. Let me in. Let me in. You know what? I'm opening it myself. Guess who? What in the world are you doing here? I'm here to help you. I can't let you go to boarding school, bruh. I'm not allowed to go there. So we gotta get this house together. Dude, I'm telling you, it's just not possible. No matter how much I clean it, she's not gonna be satisfied. She's probably at work right now on her phone looking for what all girls boarding school she can send me to right now. Ooh, this one looks nice. There's no helping me, okay? Look, I, I really appreciate the effort, but this is over. I'm done. I really messed up this time. Well, we, we gotta try, right? With the two of us, the house might turn out better than expected. Come on. And if 
it won't prevent your mom from sending you away, then at least we get to hang out together for one more day. You're supposed to be at school. Are you trying to get yourself in trouble? Ah, I live by myself. My parents are gone. I'm not gonna get in trouble at all. But I'll help you clean and we'll have a nice hangout together. All right, I guess. But if my mom comes home early and catches you, that's your fault, not mine. So what should I do first? Literally everything and anything. Go, 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 move. So since uh, this is our last day hanging out, maybe we should end it off with a little kiss. I have a hot iron in my hand and you want to talk to me about kissing? Not going to happen. We had a great time, but I never agreed to be your girlfriend and it's just not going to happen. Sorry, dude. <sighs> well, it was worth a shot. You can't blame a guy for trying. True, but we're literally in my mom's bedroom cleaning up. I can blame you if she says it's still dirty. Get to scrubbing the floors harder. Gosh, I'm doing it. I'm doing it. All right. All right. Man, <sighs> this is sad, but it's a great last day. Uh-oh. Who, who's at the door? Dude, someone is at the door right now. You need to hide. I think my mom came back home early to spy on me. Uh, what? Hide? Hide where? I don't know. In the bathroom. Just go, go, go. I need to see who's at the door. Look, if you're caught here, my mom might send me to military school instead of boarding school. Okay, okay, I'll hide. Oh, crap. Hold on, I'm coming. Wait. What, what the heck? What are you doing here? Hey, open up. It's your neighbor. Hello, young lady. Your mom told me that you got yourself into some big trouble. So she called me and asked me to come check out the house. Oh, um, well, as you can see, it's just me here cleaning up like she told me to. So no need to look around and check. I don't know. She told me to be very detailed about it. So I'm gonna have to come in and look around. All right. So you'll excuse me. Okay. Well, how about I just show you around or something? Huh? I can show you everything that I've cleaned so far. And then you'll know that nobody's here but me. Nah, you stay right here at the door. I could check the house by myself. No need to worry. Starting with your bedroom, which is over here, right? Yep. My bedroom's right over there. Huh? No need to check it though. I just mopped in there. So the, the floor is wet. Probably. I'm not scared of a little bit of water. Don't worry. Oh my gosh. This is bad. If he's gonna check every room, that means he's gonna find him here. I gotta warn him while he's in the other room. I knew it. I can't sneak nothing past my mom. I should never told him he could stay. Hey, what the? What are you doing? Hiding in the bathtub? What does it look like? Well, you need to hide better. Run through the backyard or something. My neighbor is here to check on the house. My mom made him. Uh oh. This is bad. All right. I'll hide. I hope he picks a good spot. Otherwise, I am cooked. <sighs> okay, I'll just stay here and hopefully everything will be fine. Oh, this is so bad. Hmm, okay. Seems like her bedroom is clear and really clean all right time to check the other rooms anyone in here hello oh this is the garage nice and empty too all right so far so good okay bathroom number two clear and here we are in the last room oh this is good news i have all good things to report to her mom nobody's here at this house at all Ugh, so how did everything go well we're all good here yep i'll call your mom and let her know that everything's clear here <sighs> you need to stay out of trouble though you know your mom's a very very serious woman you can't be missing around with her what did you do anyways huh stole some money from her wallet no no absolutely not i would never oh okay i see i see you snuck out of the house then huh went to some parties um no goodness what did she tell you look i went on a date that she allowed me to go on and i missed my curfew that's it and she ended up calling the police because i told her to oh yikes uh, well, it was nice knowing you. You're definitely going to boarding school. Bye. Oh, that was a close one. Dude, where are you? Hello? Oh, the back door's open. Are you back here? He's gone. He's gone. You could come out now. Oh, I thought I was goner, bruh. He was right outside this window. <sighs> I'm such a good hider. Yeah, I guess so. But look, my mom must have more tricks up her sleeves, okay? We've got to say goodbye. You can't be caught here again. Who knows who else she has spying on me? But I, I don't want to say goodbye. I'm having a good time cleaning up the house with you, you know? And we've got it pretty clean. Exactly. The house is pretty clean, so we're just gonna ask... Well, not we. I'm gonna ask her if you know, it's good enough for, for me to not get shipped away, but it's a definite no-go if you're still here. I need you to leave. And if this is our last time seeing each other, then then I love you, okay? I mean it. Whoa, I, I was just gonna say goodbye. That's a little much. Moving kind of fast, right? Look, I've been chasing you for months, okay? Nothing is too fast for me. I just can't believe once I finally got us on good terms, you gotta go. Look, I'll just try my best to talk to her, okay? And yeah, go ahead and just go. This is too risky. All right, well, goodbye then. 
I guess. <sighs> this sucks. Whew, that was a close one. The house is so sparkling clean now since it was two people instead of one and the neighbor's check went good. I think I might be able to stay here and keep going to school and get unbanned from boys. Oh crap. Well, we're cooked. Her mom just got home. Well, 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 look who it is. You wanna tell me what you're doing at my house, huh? I am so so ready to hear this. Go on, explain yourself. Uh, well, you know, I just was, just got back from school a little bit early today and your daughter wasn't there. So I, I just came over to check, you know, if she was like, okay. And she never answered the door. So I'm just gonna go home now. Oh, really? You want me to actually believe that? So go ahead and tell me the truth right now. And maybe I won't kill you. Um, well, uh, well, so, uh, what's that noise? Oh my crap. No. Oh, mom, you're back. Hey, 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 how's it going? Oh, whoa, what are you doing here? Shocking. I, I was so busy cleaning up in the backyard. I didn't hear anybody at the door. What's going on? Your little friend here was just going to explain to me what the heck he's doing at my door. Huh? Is somebody going to tell the truth? Oh, yeah. What are you doing here, uh, dude? Uh, well, um, go on, spit it out. No need to lie. I've already picked out a nice all-girls school in another state for her. So you might as well just tell me what's going on. And maybe I'll let you guys get one last goodbye. All right. Well, <sighs> for being honest, dude, what are you doing? Don't say anything. It's a trap. I, I came over to help her clean up the house. Partly, this was my fault for taking her on the yacht and leaving her outside super, super late at night. And so I felt like I should take part in this punishment. And I helped her clean up the house and it looks really, really good. Oh, really? So you were here the entire time, huh? When I had the neighbor come and check, he said he didn't see anyone. W were you hiding? Yes, ma'am. I was hiding. But I, I felt really guilty about what I had to do with this. And I just decided to help her clean up. It was really nothing more than that. No weirdness. Just me trying to pay for what I I did. And is this true? Ray, don't lie to me. Well, uh, <laughs> that is partly true. Don't lie. Okay, okay. It, it's the truth. Yes, he was here all day helping me clean up, but nothing happened. Nothing weird at all. He really did just want to help me out, and I had a feeling you were going to send me to boarding school regardless, so it was just like one last chance to hang out and cleaning up. That's it, okay? Nothing else. You two, get inside now. We need to talk. Oh, crap. Did I say the wrong thing? Yeah, you idiot. No, duh. Now you're grounded, too. She might even ship you off to military school. She can't do that, can she? I don't know. I have no idea what she's capable of, but we need to get in there right now. Okay, mom, we're both here. Uh, what's going on? Is, is everything okay? Uh, let me think. <sighs> so, at first you hated this guy. He was super creepy. Then he asked you on a date and you went. And then you told me to call the police if something happened to you. And I called the cops and all of a sudden you two are besties. Something is missing from this story and you're gonna tell me both of you now no secrets spit it out oh um well you first ray tell me what's going on with you two huh all right look all those times i told you that this guy was a creep and he was stalking me and he was obsessed it was true he really was ask him well were you yeah but i mean all guys are like that when they have a crush right i'm uh, that's gotta be true no but keep going okay so he was a creep right and then I blackmailed him at school because I thought that he was watching me in the girl's bathroom. <gasps> what? Yeah, but, 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 but he wasn't. He wasn't. I was in the boy's bathroom. What? Uh, but, but she didn't know. She was in a rush because she tried to get back to class. And so then since she had threatened to tell on me, I threatened to tell on her and said I wouldn't say anything if she went on a date with me. So I tried to sneak away from him, which is why I was super late coming home that one day. And it didn't work. He was here waiting for me. So I went on the date because I did not want to get in trouble for being in the boys' bathroom. And we went on the date and it was really nice. But because I was blackmailed into it, I told you to call the police after an hour. And he turned out to not be that bad of a guy once I gave him a chance. Yeah, she's totally into me. Uh-huh. So let me get this straight. This whole time he's been chasing you, he went about it all wrong. And once he got the chance to force you into a date, he did it. Uh, yeah, sorry about that. I am not done. Then you actually enjoyed the date and realized that I was right about you two this whole time. Time? That you two should be together? Well, I don't know about all of that, but I think we could at least be friends. 
she's totally into me. I am not. Don't listen to him. All right, all right. We work together to clean up the house, just like you said, okay? Uh, are you still gonna send me off to an all-girls school in another state? Look, if you send her to an all-girls school, you gotta send me to the all-girls school, too. That's not how that works, and I'm not your mom. I can't send you anywhere. What is wrong with you two? Um, you're just really scary. All right, fine. You two are forgiven. I guess you could stay at your normal school, but no more keeping secrets, and you stay out of the boys' bathroom. You got it? I've always told you, pay attention to your surroundings. Now, look, I almost shipped you off for good. Yes, ma'am. So sorry about that, by the way. I am too. Now you, get out of my house. And you, young lady, you're still grounded. Go to your room. But what? You heard me. Or would you rather go to a different school, huh? Because we can all pack your bags as a little group. Nope. Uh, I'm going to my room right now. Bye, dude. I guess I'll see you at school tomorrow. Oh, man. Whew. That was close, but at least I'm only grounded, not being shipped off to school. And you, young man, don't ever think you can force my daughter into anything else, all right? So you're grounded too. Go to your room. Uh, well, I'm e Okay, yes, ma'am. Again, sorry about all the confusion. Uh, and here's your mop. I'll just put it over here. Goodbye now. <sighs> Teenagers, they give me such a headache. I cannot let my daughter date this guy. It's just gone too far. Too many secrets. I'll just have to move us to a new neighborhood. Yeah, then we'll just start over fresh. There's something off about this kid.